Hello my YouTube friends and family. Today I'm just going to make a quick, simple, short video about my breakfast. I have bananas, blueberries, strawberries, and I have avocado. Okay, this is very healthy, very nutritious, very light on the stomach. It gives you energy. It doesn't make you sluggish. It doesn't make you um, constipated. It doesn't make you feel heavy on the stomach. As a matter of fact, it lifts your spirits. You know, um, it gives you a lot of energy that should last you through the day. Okay? And it's so good. I think I'm missing my pecans and dates. I should have added them too. It's so full of life, minerals, enzymes, what we need to function throughout the day. Um, it's so... It's everything you need to carry on your work. And so, I just changed up my eating habits in the morning. Instead of just having a, something like just dates and heading out to work, I decided to add more fruit. And um, add more fruit throughout the day. That way I can stay energized, um, strong, because I have rheumatoid arthritis. You want to balance out your fruits. You got your potassium. You got your, um, your antibodies to keep the immune system boosted up, healthy. And you have your avocado, the correct kind of fat that your body needs to function. It's, that's where you get the good stuff is in the avocado. Mm -hmm. It's very nice. You should try it sometime. Mm -hmm. This year I'm going to plant strawberries in my garden. I'm going to try to do it for my grandson because he loves strawberries. And um, I was thinking about doing an avocado tree for my daughter. But those things take such a long time to produce fruit. And um, you need certain soils for certain fruits like... Um, like if I was to grow oranges or apples, I would need that kind of soil where those kind of fruits would grow in. I would say oranges, grapefruits, and lemons. Apples, they can grow where I live. Yeah, they're pretty good. They're pretty simple to grow. I want a plum tree, though. But um, the strawberries are nice mixture. Very sweet. Mm hmm. See? Do it like that. Put it in the light so you can see it. Very nice. Very yummy. Very nutritious. Very healthy. Yes. Takes your mind off of what you got to face today. Yeah. Very nice. You eat live foods because you're alive. You want to stay that way. Yeah. Very nice. Very nutritious. And those blueberries look so good with those bananas. Oh my gosh. No, oh, I can't help it. Mm-hmm. Oh gosh, I need blackberries too. That would be so nice. I'll do that later. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, remember to eat the bananas with the brown spots. That way they're ripe. Don't eat the green bananas because that's really going to constipate you and mess with your your body, your intestines. You don't want to do that. But look at that freshly cut avocado. <clears throat> Excuse me. The weather keeps changing here. It rains. It it doesn't rain, the sun is out, then it, then um, the temperatures are like 19 or 34 degrees, then they're like 68 sometime. I'm like, really? This is so weird. So, this is what I'm, I'm doing to boost my immune system, to give me energy throughout the day, to keep me energized, to uh, keep me vibrant, 
and it's anti-aging because what you eat determines how you look, what you're going to look like later. Um, you got to eat the proper foods to make your hair grow, eat the proper foods to help your skin, eat the proper foods to keep the wrinkles away. Yes, yes. Very nice, nutritious. I love it. You can't help it, you know. I call this my real finger food. Mm -hmm. Very enjoyable, delightful, scrumptious. Very nice. Mm hmm. I have spinach. I was going to add spinach to it, but that would have been that too much. I'll just do the spinach later with the blackberries and dates and some tomatoes. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And that's, that'll be my salad. <laughs> but anyway, this is my breakfast. Quick, simple, easy to digest breakfast. You know, Very light on the stomach. Very nice. <clears throat> yeah, let me place it for the world. Not the stuff that I see out here now, though, anyway, so let me pick that up. And it's good, very good, you know, enjoyable. <clears throat> and um, wash it down with coconut water. That sounds good. Mm -hmm. I'll get some of that. Be very nice, healthy, nutritious. And when you eat a healthy breakfast, have consume a lot of. Fruits, vegetables, raw. You help your skin. You help your hair. You help the blemishes on your body disappear. Regardless whether you're male or female, it helps you. <clears throat> you like I said, you can't go wrong with nature. Nature was put here for us, and nature is going to be here after us. Nature has always succeeded, and our nature has always found a way to heal the body and heal itself. So you don't argue with nature. So this was put here to help the body function, help the body grow, and it's very good, especially if your kids are going to school. You want to give them something like this before they rush out the door to catch the bus. Not only it helps their immune system, it keeps them from catching colds, because in, when they're in school, they are touching, they're grabbing things, and some kids they don't wash their hands their parents are not sanitary and you want to keep your child's immune system boosted you don't want them just to rush out the door and um, go to school and they're not healthy <clears throat> I wish I had some chunks of pineapple I think I had a pineapple yeah I do oh, anyway. um, this is a good breakfast for kids they shouldn't argue it this is very nice very nutritious very lively, very healthy. You know, school lunches serve meals like this. Because you never know what they're liking at home. They can pick up someplace else. And um, as parents, we should, parents or grandparents, we should make sure our kids, adult children and grandkids are eating healthy. And that's the reason I continue to grow my, gar my uh, vegetables in my garden. Um, I'm going to grow strawberries, I'm going to grow watermelons, because it's healthy, you know. Regardless of the age of our children or grandchildren, we still should continue to encourage them to eat healthy. Because you never know, people have issues or problems that could occur throughout the day that could hinder the thinking of others, and they may not be thinking straight, and eat, eating a healthy, balanced vegetable or fruit diet 
can determine the way we think, can determine the way we act, our emotions, um, our thoughts. Because um, you, gotta, you got to be there for yourself. We are good people. You're a good person. No one's going to be there for you. Never let yourself down. Be positive. Encourage yourself. Have a passion for life. Have a passion. And my passion is my garden. I take it very seriously. I get upset when things don't grow or if I'm so some some seeds that, that will not grow that are too old or have been cooked and sold as organic. Um, I take that very seriously. And um, we should all be careful what we consume and put into our bodies. Eating a healthy breakfast such as what I have before me um, is very it's a wise thing to do. Uh, it shows in your eyes, it shows in your skin if you're healthy. I was doing a lot of wrong things before and I've turned that around because I want to live. I have a passion to live. I want to do what's right. So we need to take care of ourselves. We shouldn't linger. We shouldn't let things stand in the way. We should always be positive and energized. Um, I do appreciate you watching this short video. Uh, continue to think positive. Stay focused. Never give up. Um, remember, adding vegetables, raw vegetables, raw fruit to your diet once a day can truly help the body. Um, it can help your skin, like I said, your skin, your hair, get rid of blemishes on the body, and it gives you a glow, a beautiful glow in your skin. So hit the like button, subscribe to the channel if you haven't done so already. Thank you for watching. Have a blessed day. Thank you. Bye-bye.